Hi, my name is Confused Friend Online, and welcome to another episode of Soma. Welcome if you haven't been here before, and welcome back if you have. Uh, we are on our 11th episode of Soma now. Um, so, just because there's two ones in in the in the title doesn't mean that it's the like supreme version of the first episode. Please go to the playlist on my channel that's called Soma and watch from episode one because you will probably be thoroughly entertained but also thoroughly lost in the plot. So <laughs> that's just a recommendation. I don't control your life. I'm not your dad. Um anyway as per tradition, I am lighting the old formulation of Black Cherry Merlot for our fragrance of the day. There we go. All three are up and active, baby. Awesome. Well, without further ado, let's let's get cracking. Simon and Catherine have found the Dunbat, but it's quarantined and they need to find someone to know a security trip cipher so they can gain access. Only with the Dunbat will they be able to enter the abyss and find the lost Mark. So that's the same recap they gave me for episode 10. Um, hopefully I don't have to go down into that maze basement place to restart the router because if I do, I'll cry. <laughs> God, that thing was terrifying. I didn't want to deal with it whatsoever. Uh, it was gross. Catherine, please. A simulation from the chip oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I don't have to redo everything. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Jeez. I do, however, have to figure out how the fuck to run the chip. And I'm very tempted to look it up on YouTube. Or, like... Google. Can I jump, please? Thank you. Um. But I'm determined not to. It still scares me how that is slightly open and you, all you can see is blood and gore. Also, because this is open, I know it can't get up the stairs, but... I'm paranoid. So, uh, let's click on our flashlight, open the door, and get cracking. Ew, part two. Can I get through this? Thank you. That made me jump so hard. Can't go down there. Can't go up here. Gotcha. Was anything in here that I could do with? 
I think I had to go up here. Maybe. You shined. Yes, this is where I need to be. Compression. Float tank. Reach Versailles. Where, where do I put this in? Oh. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh. Agreeable interior test, excellent data reconstructed by WoW. Do not use. Well. Guy Conrad. Death. North Englander. Float tank. Scan room with pilot seat. Better continuation, not necessary for arc. Water filled steel tank, sensory limiter. Beach, agreeable exterior test. Test applied to arc. Versailles, agreeable interior test. Excellent. Data reconstructed by Wow, do not use. Ship 41st environments. Beach, agreeable interior test applied to arc. Agreeable interior test discarded for the ski lodge. So. Okay. Restricted fire. Okay. Copy. Corrupt data. Oh! The scan room worked. Beach. In the verse. Data scan room. Better continuation, not so far. Okay. So hopefully that means we have what we need now. Ideally. Alright, let's just get back to Catherine. Hopefully that gave us the file we needed. Catherine. Run a simulation from the chip you found. You bitch! I need to go back! How the fuck do I run a simulation? Girly pop! I need step to step instructions. I'm not a scientist or a mechanic like you. I don't, I don't know what you are. <laughs> I think you're like a hybrid. Ugh. <laughs> So I think I was initially correct that I needed to get this, get that put in there so I could run the chip. I think I need to go up there and go into that other room that had the computer. I bang a right, right. It was right here, and I and I and I like was in the wrong place. Okay, cool. Okay, to the one back here. All right here we go. There should be a list of people. See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Okay. Compressed. Tingless. Sarah Lindwall. Uh, said she'd help out delivering the Ark. Um... Oh, author of Catherine Subject, March, Mark Sarang. 
um, killed himself because of continuity? Question mark. Stromer is really mad. Has tied Titan Security Arc Project on hold. Brandon Wan. Um, Delta Refugee Construct Wrangler, Wrangler. Wrangler. He's working for Stromer now. Robin. Another fucking continuity suicide. Continu Con yeah, continuity suicide. Stromer locked me out of my lab again. <laughs> Catherine. Um, Maggie Komorobi. We look so much alike. In a different life, I'm sure we'd be best friends. Heather Wolchsek. Wolchsek? Uh, she helped me cut the wave leak from the hel helmet. If anything, it should make the post skin hangover less severe. Peter Stratsky. Stratsky was cheerful and funny, as always. Alice Coster. Said she'd help construct the Ark, but not carry it to Fi. Let's try Sarah. No, it won't work. We need someone from Theta Security Group. Theta Security. Well, I know there's a list somewhere, but I don't want to look at that list, so we're gonna keep- we're gonna go through everyone. That one won't work either. Look for security people like Kronstadt or Stromar. Kronstadt or Stromar. He's working for Stromar, so maybe Brandon? Going. Sweet. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. Oh god. Mo environment none, module none. Okay. Oh god. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Oh god. Don't afraid. Chun? What happened to you? I can't see anything. Yeah. There's nothing here. Oh, poor There's guy. There's no need to worry. No, no, that's, that's a lie. You're lying. Don't get upset, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Why are, you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you. Stress will make you just put that guy to life. I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. Jeez. We turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was going to work. Maybe we can try again. Oh, if there's a way to get a different environment. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up. Bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened to you? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. Don't worry, Mr. Wan. It'll all get better. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Mr. Wan, I need you to stay calm. No, 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 no. Well, uh, why, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! This setup won't work. We need something else. How the fuck do I get to something else? Bitch! Environment data. Let's try scan room. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it? Alice? Mr. Wan, can you hear me? Chun? Where's Alice? She left. Mr. Wan, I need you to give me the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is a trick. No, it's okay, I promise. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. Oh, you God. won't break me, Wow, you hear me? You won't break me! Oh, God. He... Do we need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? 
The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So, what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Maybe the beach? That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up. Bastard. What? How did I get here? Don't be afraid, Mr. Wan. Dr. Chen, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Just be calm. Take a deep breath and enjoy the scenery for a moment. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here. It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real. This isn't real. I have to get out of here. Yeah. I think we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. We need to think this through. We need some more data. How do I get more data? Alright, let's yoink this. Keep his memory check plugged in here. Running across this hallway is where we got the other shit, so... Let's see what we can do now with more. Alright, get you plugged in here. Yep. Loading external device. Environments, scammers. Is that the Versailles? No. here. Oh, I thought I saw um, an interaction thing pop up. Let's... Jeez, one, two... Three, four, five people killed themselves. One more death and we're out. Yep, there there was Conrad. There's no simulation as it's left. Supposed to find more info to put on this fucking thing. I should probably take it with me just in case, so. Alright. Scavenger hunt time it is. I wish I knew Brandon better. What would make him talk? Oh, we need to go to the to the rooms and find his room. You know what? Go look for Brandon's room. Let's do some investigation. I'm sure we can get to him somehow. That's what I'm doing, girly pop. Here we go. Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Oh, thank you, Kath. If we 
get to know him, maybe we can make the situation a little smoother. Okay, there's a lot going on here. I don't see his sewer slide stuff. So it wasn't hanging and it wasn't by slitting his throat like that one girl did. An award for achievements of the engineering youth. Interesting. Pagodas, nice. He was very into travel. Brandon, you ready to go? Strohmeyer says it's time to move. I'm waiting for Strasky and I'll borrow to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs and I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. Hmm. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. Heard some lady telling Brandon to hurry up. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer, hang on. That's Alice Coster. Wouldn't have guessed they even knew of each other. Interesting. Well, he was looking for Alice and- Oh my gosh, he has one of those freaking frogs! Like, like, like the origami frogs that actually hop when you- Oh my god, I remember making those all the fucking time when I was a kid. Oh my god. <clears throat> oh my. There's a note from Alice that makes me think she was scanned alongside Brandon. Okay, that sounds really promising. We can definitely use that. Brandon, I'm really a mess- I think got this, oh. Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. Oof. We can trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. Good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. <laughs> Staff Wrangler named Brandon Wallen, sex, um, 177 centimeters. I speak American, not whatever that nonsense is. He's Chinese, he was born in Hong Kong. He is a Wrangler, works at Delta. I'm just gonna read the note because I, I didn't realize when I put the note down that it was gonna say anything. I was trying to figure out how to like get the thing. The thing that makes it like that pops up the actual like info like the the for when i can't fucking read it <laughs> anyway brandon i'm really a mess about the scan everyone is being so brave all smiles no regrets you know how you said you would hold my hand during the scan if the offer still stands i gratefully accept if we do it together we could suffer the hangover together as well they say it takes a couple of days to recover Kisses, Alice. Oh, lovers. There's them. Cute. Damn right, Simon. And a paper crate. He liked origami. I like him. I like Brandon. He was nice. Oh, I'm guessing those are probably his parents. Akers finally agreed to evacuate Delta. Goya, Krieger, and I are moving into theater today. Akers said he'd stick around for a while longer. That crazy bastard. I take pride in my work, but goddamn, that place is miserable since the surface stopped sending parts. I found more evidence suggesting they were together during the scan. That's okay, Sherlock. We got it already. We should focus on simulating Brandon Wan. Uh, well, yeah, but I am currently snooping, so let, let me embrace my inner gossip, gossip girl, okay? Thank you, Catherine. Did my, art, did my art scan together with Alice? Stromer told me that the hangover would basically kill me. Such an asshole. I was fine at first, but I got a splitting headache a couple of hours later. The biggest pain was that Chun girl. She's so fucking uncomfortable at all times, it makes my skin crawl. Be nice to, about Catherine. Stromer went ballistic and shut down all future scans for the ARC project. Apparently, Conrad wanted in on the continuity and just fried himself right in the pilot seat after the scan. Something tells me we'll be getting new security ciphers. 
just heard that the uh, Komobro, Komo, Komoebi, Komoebi, I'm gonna say Komoebi, just heard that the Komoebi survey team is going to Delta to pick up hackers. He's been alone for months now. I can't imagine what he's been up to. Oh. Time to trick um, Brandon into thinking that uh, where his his uh, his beloved Alice. I compiled an Alice module that we can use. So she'll be with Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. I'll still need to do the talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. All right. Scanner room. This feels so scummy, but we need to do it. Here we go. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had a couple. Ooh, the double tone voice. He said he needed a new cipher ASAP. What should I tell him? It's alright. I can talk to him. Wait. Didn't Sean just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry, I'm not gonna tell anyone. I do feel hungover. Okay. It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? No. I'm sorry, Mr. Long. enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. We just give I'm this... not sure what to do with the data. You decide. <sighs> well, every time it seemed to be that he just restarted. So he's not going to be able to tell. He's stuck in an internal loop of questioning anyway, so it's best to let sleeping dogs lie. Might need this. Oh, I can't take it in my inventory later. God. Catherine, you better have remembered that what that fucking password was, because... Girl, I got no clue. I do not remember it. I already Simon, forgot. Got it. We can get to the dumbat now. Get back here. That's what I'm doing. That motherfucker just flashed a saving icon at me. I'm not comfortable anymore. The sound thing is like, haha, I'm in danger. That. That's what's going through my mind right now. Flashlight on. Catherine, couldn't we just have extracted the cipher from Brandon's data somehow? It's so cruel bringing it back like we did. No, that's impossible. Memories don't work like that. Let's just hope it was worth it. Considering the state of the bottom of the ocean, I'd hate to see what the world is like above. It probably won't be worth it. Sorry, Simon. This is so there you are. somber. Just up the Dunbat for us. It's been collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. That seemed a bit quicker okay. than the minute. That's it. That's everything. Let's go ahead and huh. That's weird. Huh. Never mind. Catherine, what tell me what the do? fuck you. Head inside the dock. The Omnitool can open the door now and get into the Dunbat. Then plug me in, and I'll take us into the abyss. Sounds easy enough. What? Okay, well, how do I know what the Dunbat looks like? Whatever. There's gonna be creatures in there, I know it. I know it, there's gonna be creatures, and I'm gonna be freaked out, and then I'm gonna have nightmares for two weeks afterwards. Oh. 
Entrance to the Dumbat, here we go. Oh, is this the fucking passcode thing? God damn it. Hold on. I thought I just completely. Oh. I thought I completely, like, missed. Oh. Cool. I don't know what the cipher is still. What do, what do I do? What do I... Oh! Whoa. Hello. Perfect, all systems okay. Preparing release. Ready for release, okay. Release in progress. <laughs> God. What the hell? Okay. Okay, a lot of people really don't like Catherine. Wow, okay. Um. So far down. What just happened? It it's not up there anymore. It should be. exactly what I needed. Perfect. Guess we're abandoning the Dunbat. <laughs> Bye Dunbat. Can't believe that happened. I think 
this is a wonderful place to stop. Okay, wow. Um, I only had to look, I, I thought I had to remember a cipher. I didn't even think, I thought, I don't know why I thought I had to know the cipher, but um, God. So, anyway, that was, um, very packed with story, significantly less monsters than the last couple episodes, so I'm not too angry about that. Um, in any case, I hope you had as much fun watching as I did playing, um, and if you did enjoy, feel free to drop a like on my video, I really appreciate it, it just lets me know that you actually do enjoy what I do, even though I do this for fun, so I'm gonna do it anyway, even if you don't like it. Um, and if you keep finding yourself coming back to my channel, feel free to drop a little subscribe and maybe a little ring the bell icon, cause, uh, then you'll know exactly when I drop a video, which is every Thursday at 3 o'clock Eastern Time, just in case you didn't know. And if you're feeling particularly generous, uh, take a look in the description below where I have my Patreon linked. Make it so that way I can pay Chris, my editor. Because right now he's unpaid, and he's not going to get paid <laughs> until I can pay him. Just, just, it, it, it. <laughs> Subscribe to a tier on my Patreon if you, if you want to support my editor's living wage. Because <laughs> apparently he doesn't make one. <laughs> Sorry, Chris. Love you. <laughs> anyway, I hope you have a good rest of your day. No, a fantastic rest of your day. See ya! I'd like to thank everybody for joining me for today's gaming sesh. I love video games, and I love sharing that passion with others even more. None of this YouTube stuff would be possible without you guys. Though we are small in numbers, I figured I'd offer you more ways to support the channel other than just subscribing to my YouTube. My solution? Subscribe to my Patreon. This will help me buy games to expand the scope of entertainment for you to consume here on my channel. It will also help me pay my lovely editor, Chris. The button to sub on my channel is down below, and then below that, in the description, is the link to sub to my Patreon. I hope to meet you there. See ya!